Hello, ILRIs. This is Dean Colvin. I want to congratulate all of you for finishing up what has been perhaps the most unusual semester in the 75-year history of the ILR school. You've been studying in the midst of a global pandemic, obviously an incredibly challenging time to be a student, a period of intense social unrest, a contentious election season. 2020 is a year that none of us will ever forget. You've had to alter your lives, follow safety protocols, whether you're here on campus or um, studying from away. And you've had to do all this to keep each other out of harm's way. But you've done so incredibly successfully, keeping the spread of the virus low in our community throughout this period of in-person instruction. It was something I think many doubted that Cornell could manage, and particularly people doubted whether Cornell students could manage to follow the guidelines, keep our community safe, um, and you've done an amazing job. And I think you deserve enormous kudos for all your efforts this term. I think you've also been really impressive in how much care you've shown for each other. When I've seen students um, here on campus or over the Zoom, um, I've been incredibly impressed with the care that you show for each other. Um, this is a time of great mental stress uh, for many of us. Um, the mental health of your classmates is something that I, I know is a priority for um, so many of our students as it is for us and the faculty and staff who are here to support you. Um, and I really wanna thank you for all the efforts that um, you've made to focus on the well-being of our community. It may not seem it right now in the midst of all the challenges that we're facing uh, this year, but I think you're gonna look back in the fullness of time with some pride as to the efforts um, and the role that you played in uh, making this educational experience, this community continue to function in very difficult circumstances. You've displayed great values and uh, real pride in what you could accomplish as Cornellians and as ILREs. So congratulations to each of you. As many of you are now enjoying time at home with your families over the holidays, I do wanna ask you to please continue to be safe. Uh, this is a tough time nationally with cases high and the danger of contagion during these periods. Um, you know, And I think we're all gonna be reliant on each other to be responsible and to follow the best health uh, guidelines that um, um, are there to keep us all safe. Um, it's certainly one of the real bright, shining lights at the end of the year that we're now starting to see uh, vaccinations beginning. Um, it's a great testament to science um, that vaccines have been developed so quickly and are now out there protecting people, uh, particularly the most vulnerable in our society and the healthcare workers who are and the, who have been so important in responding to this pandemic. But we've got to recognize it's going to take some months before uh, the population as a whole can be vaccinated. Uh, there are some who um, have to be vaccinated first because they're at greater risk. Uh, eventually, we're all going to have the opportunity to get uh, vaccinated and we're going to be able to gradually return to more normal life. Um, however, that's important to recognize that this is not the time to be complacent, given that we can see uh, the ending of this pandemic um, on the horizon. Uh, we want to stay safe up through that period of time. Um, that's going to mean for the spring semester that we also have to take the precautions again that we did in the fall uh, because we won't have the whole population vaccinated. Uh, so, um, you know, we're going to have another semester of um, hard work um, to make sure that we can keep um, our community going, our education going during these difficult times. But it's good to know that there is hope and help on the way um, and we see uh, a path out of uh, these difficult situations we're in. I want to finish up by mentioning that we have a group of students who graduated this semester. I've communicated with each of them directly, welcoming them as a member of our ILR alumni community. Uh, so congratulations to all of them. Uh, for those of you who are returning to campus in the spring semester, we're going to be resuming our COVID guidelines and testing, um, all our protocols. That information is going to be communicated again to you as we get closer to that point in time. To finish off, congratulations to everyone again for uh, tremendous efforts this fall semester. I've been incredibly proud of all of you, of our students, as well as the faculty and staff, uh, all their efforts to give you as good an educational experience as they could 
during this uh, difficult time. Thank you all for your resilience, your perseverance, and have a safe and happy holiday season.